but I think the one that sticks out the most are just activities and games that we've done in the St. John building, whether it be sardines in the dark going in the basement or activities in the gym. My favorite memories from the winter retreat was I like the cosmic tubing and then I like staying up to like 1 a.m. One of my favorite things about youth group was the level and depth of discussion that we were able to engage in about uh, the Word of God and just kind of thinking about and thinking about life as a Christian in general, um, specifically in the uh, the meetings themselves, but also uh, David would take me out to coffee and we'd discuss things um, you know, theologically or just life-based, and I really um, admired that connection. When we went to Houston for the uh, National Youth Gathering, uh, it was just super cool to see all the all the followers of Jesus there, especially like one of the nights when we were in the stadium and you could just see, like look out across everybody and there was like thousands upon thousands of people there and it was, it was really powerful. What did you appreciate most about your time in Nashville? I'd probably say definitely connecting with the youth group leaders, um, growing closer to you guys were it was really good for me and you guys were such good mentors. Having that group and like the people that I'm really comfortable with and I know I can talk to about anything, whether that be my questions about faith or just questions about life in general and being able to just have that like support group that I can talk to if I'm ever going through anything. Um, and the trips we went on were always fun. David found a way to keep them like very entertaining at all times. And it was just, it was a blast. All the friendships I've made, I've had, made a lot of friends and I've been with them for a while. I, just, I mean, some people that I, that don't, aren't here anymore that I still talk to them and some people that are still here. I have a feeling I'll talk to them for a long time. Like long friends. So. I've appreciated all the friendships as well and I've made so many new friends here. I've only been here for like a year and it's been like greatest memories here and coming closer to God and just everything I've learned from coming here. Um, I really appreciated like the deep conversations we'd have, like on that fall retreat and that retreat, we'd have like two and a half hour deep conversations and it helped me understand the confusing parts that I didn't get. What is something you learned about following Jesus that you'll take into this next season of life post high school? Just the way that, not necessarily about Jesus, but about being a Christian and really being open to share that faith, but also be very secure when attacks come at it. Learning to like lean on other people, like you can't grow um, on your own as much as you grow when you're with other people and grow in Christ and your relationship with Him. A lot of like personal growth, like, because this is like a good community, but um, going into college and stuff, I'll probably like take how to grow on my own with the Lord. For me, slowing down is important. I like being productive and a busy guy, so learning to take the time to settle and take rest in God and reading the Bible and praying is really important to me. And I think if I can learn to um, develop healthy habits like that and learn to take out the distractions here and there, um, that's gonna be a great first step for me to follow Jesus better. A big point they covered at the youth gathering that I that stuck with me is um, they said that Christianity is not about what you've done for God, but it's what God has done for you.